Tax season is here and our friends from Hilltop Wealth Solutions will share with us some tips on tax preparations. This segment is sponsored by Hilltop Wealth Solutions. Well, Eric Brenner with Hilltop Wealth Solutions is back this week on Hometown Living. He joins us with valuable insight and a special offer just for our Hometown Living viewers. Let's take a look. Well, Eric, we know tax time is upon us, and if we've worked for people or with people, we expect a W-2 or a 1099 in the mail. Do employers or, or people that you've worked with have a deadline uh, in which to get those forms to you? Um, well, the W-2s need to go out by the end of the month, end of January. And then, Craig, if they have investment accounts, um, they don't, the investment firms don't have to send those out until mid-February. And oftentimes, people don't get them till about the beginning of March. So I would encourage people that if they have other investment accounts and so forth, they got to wait until those documents come in uh, before they take them to the preparer, probably March or so, beginning of March. Wow. So if you're, you know, some people like to get those things right away and race to get that refund. Um, I haven't had a tax refund in years. I don't know what that feels like, but uh, so you, some people you just got to wait and, and closer to that deadline. So, yeah, you, know, you do. Yeah, you do with those forms, uh, depending on if they have investment accounts or not. Sure. So, you know, the pandemic has caused things to be different for lots of folks this year, including people that maybe haven't had to ever file for unemployment. So are there tax implications or forms that you get in regards to your unemployment check? So unemployment is taxable. And uh, that is a that's a good question, because I think uh, there could be people that didn't realize that. And they may be a bit surprised, especially uh, if they weren't planning on paying some tax on their unemployment and income. Right. What about stimulus money? Stimulus checks are were not taxable. So uh, unlike unemployment, that is taxable. The stimulus checks were tax free from the government. Gotcha. So, you know, the end of the year is sometimes a race to the finish, right? You've got Christmas, you've got New Year's, you've got all these things that we're doing in our personal lives. But, you know, there's some money things that you've really got to try to take care of before the end of the year, too. So if I want to donate to like my IRA for 2020, is the deadline passed? Am I out of luck? So if, yeah, if you are eligible to contribute to either a traditional IRA or Roth IRA, you can actually do that up until April 15th of this year for the previous year. And in fact, you can get your taxes done and just indicate that you're going to do that. And just as long as you have the money in your IRA account by the uh, 15th of April, you'll be fine. So given the low tax rate that we're enjoying right now, um, are there things that people should be doing now instead of waiting, since waiting means unknown? Yeah, it is unknown and it really is unknown. And you know, we, we uh, on the show and we encourage people all the time that look, we're in 40 year tax lows here. Taxes are gonna go up. Um, they may not be raised uh, this year, or there may be certain pieces raised, but they're going to go up. So planning uh, now is the time because things are going to change in the future. Great. So your company, Hilltop, uh, has so many services, but you have some services specifically geared around taxation and understanding uh, your rights and your abilities within that framework. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, we do. So, you know, we have a wealth management financial planning uh, uh, service as well as we have ta full tax preparation um, and tax planning service. So certainly the tax business is starting to fire up here because people are going to be getting all their forms and start their their tax business. And we just think it's really important to have an uh, uh, integrated um, um, advice um, for someone, especially when it comes to their tax situation. Eric, you're like a one stop shop. In some ways we are. We won't change oil in your car though. Oh, darn it. See, you had me until then. No, but you know, I do think it's some, you know, sometimes it's really frustrating that you have to wait for those forms and then you've got to take them from point A to point B and deal with other people. And so the folks at, at your office can just kind of handle everything and time it out perfectly for you. And I bet if I was a betting man, I would bet you have some sort of special 
in regards to this right now for our hometown uh, living viewers? Yeah, we do. Um, you know, we're offering new tax clients a 20% off their tax preparation fee. But I would I would call our office, uh, the number there, 889-7526. Um, and let them know that you want uh, our tax service, even if you're not ready for a few weeks, because you know we're getting a, we're offering this 20% and we're getting a lot of new client requests and we may get to a point where we can't do that. And so I would encourage people to do that. If you're a small business, we also have small business accounting services. So we certainly can take care of those needs and offering a 10% discount for the first year in working with small businesses. Eric, you know the thing I think that you offer that's most important is peace of mind understanding that everything is going to get taken care of. So I encourage the folks at home to give Eric a call at uh, Hilltop Wealth Solutions. Thanks for being with us here again on Hometown Living. Thank you, Craig. For more information, you can visit hilltoptax.com or give them a call at 574-889-7526. Give them a call and get a 20% discount on tax prep. That can add up uh, to quite the savings, so yeah. check them out. We also want to remind folks that you can watch the weekly TV show Your Wealth Health every Saturday morning at 9.30 on Fox Machina. Well, coming up